A filtered sun, the theme for this afternoon, remaining dry and comfortable. If you've got after school activities going on, they will be able to uh, hit the fields. Gets well without a hitch. Looking at our hurricane barrier camera in Providence, you can see that there are a lot of high thin clouds overhead. We're still able to get sunshine through those clouds, so a partly sunny day today. And we'll see more of the same through the rest of the afternoon. Staying dry this afternoon and this evening. In fact, leading edge of some showers likely won't arrive until well after midnight into early tomorrow morning. And when they do come through, it'll be very light and spotty with most of us ending up with less than a tenth of an inch of rain. So we'll keep our threat tracker in the green rest of today and on Wednesday, Thursday as well, though likelihood of rain going back up on Thursday along with the temperatures dropping. We're already about 10 degrees warmer than we were all day yesterday, mid to upper 60s right now from Providence to Newport and Westerly 67 in John Warwick. Top of the bay coming in around 70 degrees. Tiverton reporting in right now at 59. Rhode Island College right around 70, a comfortable afternoon for grabbing a little lunch outdoors in Cumberland at 68. So fronts now sitting offshore, a wave of low pressure will ride along the front passing to our south tonight, just close enough to brush us with that thicker cloud cover and a few showers. This is the more significant system that will dig down south and eastward over the next two days and give us uh, some more significant rainfall as we head into your Thursday and Friday. So let's track it all for you. Future cast 4 o'clock this afternoon showing more of those high clouds streaming up from the southwest. This is midnight, still dry, but the rain getting closer to us and a few of those late showers impacting us early tomorrow before moving out. So the evening looking dry and the nighttime on Wednesday night into Thursday morning by Thursday, mid late morning, certainly in the afternoon, rain looking likely and it'll be chilly to go along with those showers and more significant rainfall than what we're going to see for tonight. So future cast rest of today looking dry afternoon temperatures climbing a few more degrees into the lower 70s, partly sunny. If you're headed down to the shore after work, 65 for the air temperature, water temperature running at about 55 degrees and we're looking pretty good on the bay too. winds about five to 10 knots out of the north. We just had a low tide and a high tide coming up at 639 this evening. After midnight tonight, a few showers sweeping through and they'll be with us during the morning hours tomorrow. I should say for your Wednesday morning, uh, brighter as we head into the afternoon hours with again a few of those showers the early part of the day. So getting up into the low 70s again tomorrow afternoon, clouds in the morning, brighter in the afternoon. We're dry for a big part of Wednesday, Wednesday night, and then Thursday looking at numerous rain and drizzle moving through about an inch, inch and a half of rain possible when you combine Thursday and Friday. It'll be unseasonably chilly too. Looks like it'll dry out by Friday evening with Saturday and Sunday daytimes both looking dry. We'll bring back a chance of showers Sunday night and